Hello everybody and welcome to the Science History. Today we're going to carry on and have another look at the incredibly brilliant Xeon. So yeah, it's just it's just a lush sounding synth, isn't it? I'm using this green recorder because A it looks nice. But I'm not using the uh, the audio, I'm using um the other audio, direct audio recorded into SIP because it's stereo. So I'm going to record some uh, <clears throat> of the arpeggiator of the arpeggiator. Unfortunately, you can't save the arpeggiator. I don't think as yet. <clears throat> it's unfortunate, I guess, because that would be really good. But you, to enter notes, you just basically select the step you would like to uh, enter, and then you can hit the note. But you must remember to press the little right key next to the play button. And then you can step along and say put another one there and another one there and then you can play it or alternatively press the little uh, you stop that press the erase and get rid of those erase 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 or you can let me just pick a better sound for this uh, do that one You can use auto increment, so you just uh, press the right uh, little pencil again and make sure auto increment is highlighted. And as you play, it will add notes to the grid. So, and then when you play it, it'll be. And then you can drop out notes. Just hit the erase. Erase. Erase that one. That's pretty cool. But you can also do, let's see if we can just erase um, all of them. Like that, select them all. <clears throat> what the cool thing is, you can also write in chords. So we could put this first chord in. I don't, I think this is a mono sound. So let's go back to a, a stereo sound here. Hang on a sec. We'll find it in a minute. So. <laughs> Yeah, we'll choose that one. So the cool thing is now that you can, as you see, you can, let me just erase that one. You can add in chords. And we could go through another here and add in another. And then we could go another. And then we could go to the last one here and another. So that's pretty cool as well, I reckon. I reckon that's pretty darn nifty. Select all again. To select, you just swipe your finger across the um, actual grid. Okay, so uh, let's try it with incrementing chords then. So that sounds. <clears throat> Let me just see.
Anyway, that's some of the cool things you can do with the arpeggiator anyway. But um, I want to play with some more of the sounds. <laughs> adjustments to your sound here's a thing as well also i mean you know most people are going to know this but make a new bank and then save preset as i don't know you could call it sweet pad because it's very very similar to that one but then you know you've at least saved your own sound in your own bank and you're you know kind of looking for it in xeon because i saved one yesterday down the bottom here and called it Newman because it sounded <laughs> Gary Newmanish, you know. <laughs> Superb, superb MIDI lane. Um, as Jacob has pointed out many times, he did a video um, of how to set this up. But basically, it's that simple. You just need to go to Tools here at the bottom of your... Where it says Emperor is at the top, look down, and it says Tools, and then MIDI lane, and then everything is highlighted. So, for a, say, for instance, we just wanted to uh, do the cutoff for now. And then on our MIDI controller, we just select the control we want. And then we can exit that. And you can see that our controller is now... That, that, you can't see that, actually. My, it's my control. That's the thing with this screen recording. There's no point. In I could be going like, I couldn't have my controller is controlling that now. But it's not. It's my finger. If I do this, it's my controller is controlling that now. It looks a little bit more jerky. I don't know why. Thank you. 
gibi Rich Sand and Synth. <gülüyor> Anyway, guys, there's another quick blast through with Zeon. Um, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Oh, consider becoming a Patreon too. It's very really cool. Okay, guys, uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later. <laughs>